I listed you as an artist in my channel. I don't know if it shows up or not, or how it shows up. There you have it. Um, I think it has amazing potential to be way better than the other game. Uh, but it's a little bit... Um, Evil says it's great. I'm not using a controller, so Evil says it's great with the controller, but I'm having some issues with the gun handling. Oh, I didn't have any problem with that one. <laughs> What's what? Oh no, it's just a marker that tells you where to find the... Damn right, that's a bird soul. Yeah, it's bird soul, you're right, that's right. I have no idea, I just got the game today. Learning, I'm learning. Why the hell would you want to disable bird souls? <clears throat> That's how you got to play with friends. I think we need to go about when we play these hunting games, we need to go about it differently. I think we need to hunt together and go slowly. There's a couple people in here that I think you could hunt with and be sharing. But then there's a couple of people in here that are going to be like, give me, give me. And they're going to just kill everything, get to take the best thing. Where I think what we should do is to do it like, okay, we'll hunt together. But this time, this time you get the chance to pick a litter. Next time we find some, I get to pick a litter like that. So every, and then we have the option of three people or four people to actually track the animals down. But the problem is, if you got a couple people that are gun happy and not, are not sharing people, uh, you know, that ends up to be a shit show. Like, go around and like uh, just find the stuff, track and stuff. Right. Yeah. Oh, you just put it, bring it. Can't the monster take some of this stuff? I didn't play too much of that game. I don't really like it. I am not. I don't like scary movies and stuff either. I, it's not that, I, I think it's a good game. I just, I'm, not, yeah, I think it's a very good game. Excellent, excellent game. It's, and I'm not knocking it in any way, shape or form. It's just, I am not, it's not, my thing and I'm not very good at it but Dead by Daylight I like though yeah I have it I like it I'm not real good at it but I enjoy it as long as it's not playing with people that are like putting high pressure on, you know, like we just play it casually, I like it, which is most games that at this point in life, uh, I just prefer to play games casually, not so serious. Probably the only thing I take real serious is the racing.
Oh, real life racing. Driver walks in channel saying hello. Jabber is asking you a question. Pay attention to your chat. our independence day which is why a lot of things we follow British
just Alma from Fear series. You saw me play up Fear, right? Fear 2? I believe you were there. This is uh, will not be posted anywhere but in my Patreon. I got a new patron in Patreon, so that is why I like, feel like again I'm using the same. I'm 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 ignoring the Patreon again. <laughs> All right, time to add stuff inside my Patreon. So yeah, I I don't like the idea of not showing off things to the public eye. I never like that. I always like to show everything. I don't like not sh not showing. I don't like keep things um you know, only for certain people can watch it. I want everyone to see, but you know, it's Patreon. So people support you. It can either support you for no contents, I guess. <laughs> But we don't live in a free world. And when I say world, I mean world, not United States. Most of US people think the world is revolve around them. <laughs> How sad. <laughs> I'm sorry. That is really sad. <laughs> How you play? Ah. This little girl, that's her, Alma, her name. Doing that a few days ago, I haven't tried a bit brain. Yeah, Witcher is always nice on PC. of you who wondering the way I talk I got no filter I just talk that's the thing about try to put filter into words it's just not gonna make any difference people just kinda say something don't mind me I'm not focusing on what I'm saying right now. <laughs> I'm focusing on my drawing. I don't know what is stream deck. What is stream deck? I, I don't know what is stream deck, by the way. Ah, oh, shit, I forgot her head and her hair. You 
know, I don't know about all of these names, uh, big points and stuff like that. I know I've been using stream for some time, but to actually understand in depth about what it is, I don't understand or know what it is for. <laughs> I just stream, that's all I do. I just stream. For people who want to build up channels, I'm sure they know what that is. They know what's it for, but not me. I'm, I'm, I just like to draw. I'm not looking to build my channel. I more like wanted to market my drawing. That's all. about the witcher 3 when you say the witcher i thought the witcher 1 yeah it's always better to play on pc the graphics is a lot better <laughs> obviously but you know for people like uh, want an easy access when they travel you know they want to play video games when they travel they can always <coughs> can always uh, use um, that thing but at the same time I think it's not kind of fun not to say about the time you spend you know well it depends on you actually I wanted to say, um, you know, if such thing might cause young generation to like, oh, we gotta go out and stuff like that. But, mom, I'm, uh, I'm actually play video games right now. No, you're not supposed to play video games. You're, you're supposed to spend time with your family outside. No, I wanna play video games. With kids nowadays having stuff like that, they can just play anywhere. Not that I have a problem with kids playing that in that thing, but there's a place to play that thing but when you are with your family just put that away for a moment just just put the phone away spend time with your mom and uh, with your family you know Why Batman? Why Arkham Origins specifically? Why? <laughs> I hope it's not related to me. the air conditioner my room started to feel hot <sighs> you ever I don't know if if you're in you ever you know when you were a kid you collect stuff were you a collector when you were a kid 
I got nothing better to do. When I was a kid, kind of the collector. If you are a collector, what are you into? <sighs> Don't tell me stamps, okay? <laughs> back in the days, um, I, I know kids uh, back in the days they collect stamps, but I never understand that. I mean, like, you have to go to the post office. I don't have the opportunity to go to the post office when buy stamps or anything like that when I was very young. We don't have much to waste money on such thing. I doubt kids even care about the good game or the bad game. They just care about playing, you know, kids. I mean, what do they know? They just care about playing. Hey, Miss Vibes. Hey. So my son was like, she named my plants. Get those names. <laughs> And I'm like, uh, uh, <laughs> don't say, <laughs> you know, they rely on water, soil, sunlight, <laughs> kind of like a little bit of living things, but still. Drink of fluids. You don't want to get to lay back or something. Oh my god, he's perfect ever there. I just run over a deer. <laughs> I got kill. Yeah, free meat. Is that count as a kill? And also give you SP? I know you're in a second. <laughs> it's giving me, I'm claiming the animal now. <laughs> Gives me one dollar. Tra trophy waiting. Oh, yeah, it gave me wasted. Roadkill. Roadkill, it says. I got a dollar, though. Hey, something. <laughs> I want my three dollars. Yes, there's three smackaroozies. <laughs> hey, why not? I was passing them anyway, so... Hell yeah. Hee <laughs> 
<laughs> you seem thrilled today, Miss Viper. Yeah. <laughs> She's always like that. Sort of ish. I'm in a good mood today, too. Just sitting on here waiting for. Th hey, wait, Mocus! Sit, sit down, sit down, Fuzzbutt. Get into that key. Oh, finally the carrot ready. Thirty minutes later. That's my to meter to model. Except for Evil Shadow, huh? Yeah. It'll, this too shall pass. Mm -hmm. I keep telling and reminding me of every couple hours. I'm like, drink more fluids, drink more fluids. Gotta stay hydrated. <laughs> I found a way to use Baby cakes. Nobody uses that thing. You're the first one to use that. I found a way of using baby cakes. Little. Did you see that? And uh, baby cakes is a uh, little cupcake picture that got banned on there. What the hell? You're the, you're the first person person to find that. <laughs> I would just like randomly check them out. That that uh that little picture it got banned from Twitch for from her emotes, but I used it. I figured out a way of using it. <laughs> Oh, it didn't come up. What happened? What the heck? It didn't come up this time. Oh, there it goes. Ah! See, it looks like an ass, but it's a cupcake. <laughs> Let me find out. <laughs> You're the first one to find, uncover that, Jim. Sensitive prick. Yeah. Even even in like a dancing cat, like you know how those little Instagram those cats dancing and shit. Like um, what's that one cat starts with a K or something like that? She's just like super cool, cute little like cat and stuff. But like her owner be like making her dance and shit. It's kind of funny. But um, I mean like. What's so wrong about her? Nothing wrong at all, generally. It's just the Jen. <sighs> I got no word to say. Like it won't be posted cheap. Like the like the peaches or the dancing cat or like um what you call it again? Like the little microphone cone shit, like back in the day when they do like chili eaters. Mm. It won't be used that. Apparently, it's inappropriate. Yet they let people in the stupid hot tub shit. I'm about to go off of them and <laughs> email, but like, not go off and tell them, like, yo, it's just a little microphone comb. <laughs> it's ridiculous. They're just too bored with their life. They want to be sensitive about everything. Yeah. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, but 
uh, other stuff they're not sensitive it's like extreme shit they're not ex- they're not sensitive about like you could say all kinds of shit on here and get away with it i see people do all kinds of nutty shit stuff true and mm-hmm. nobody does nothing they were like partner broadcasters they gave away with a lot of shenanigans I see people telling lies on here uh, during the protests and all that stuff. Just outright lies. COVID too, same thing. People just telling outright misinformation. Now, if I sat near this little stream, just left this on my stream, my, and then like go sat in my like lazy boy, I'd be asleep in like ten minutes. I could fall asleep fast and anywhere. Like buses, trains, doesn't matter. I sleep anywhere. Oh my god, this shit's taking forever. (laughs) See, this one, it won't allow it. This one, Twitch won't allow this. Um, strength. It's just a jiggle, like, peach fruit. There's nothing wrong with it. And, um,. There's definitely this something wrong for their sensitive ass. Like, come on, it's just a dancing little cat, like twerking, but it's just cute. Look at those eyes. Like, come on now. There's nothing wrong with that shit. It's not inappropriate. <laughs> it lets me, it lets me upload this, but um, for this shit, apparently it's inappropriate. Like that's stupid as fuck. Honestly. Which is super sensitive as a motto. I was lazy today, I didn't use a filter. Oh my god, that's a cute turtle. <laughs> Oh my god, you need a face. He's like, hello there, what's up? <laughs> Did you see my vi- stuff? Are you streaming now? I, I am, I am. Oh, uh, okay, so you didn't see my video with the, uh, where I had a full beard and all that? Mm, I don't think so. I, I played it before my stream, but I think you were already streaming. Somebody asked me how I got the name Sword and Keyboard. So I played a video that I had explaining on YouTube, explaining how I got the name and uh. Oh my goodness, that turtle! He's like, <laughs> that's so freaking cute. Last winter, I grew long hair and a, and a beard. It's like the first time I ever had a full beard in my life. <sighs> you used to have full beard? Uh, no, it's the first time I had a full beard. Was last winter. Ah. Uh. This is taking forever. My God! Oh, gonna water again. Oh, for sakes. Love it. They comment on that YouTube video. They're like, "Yo, at least a little heads up that the tomato takes long on the brow." <laughs> <laughs> what was this? The sound she's making. Oh my god! That turtle's too adorable. Oh 
Mm. It's dark. Always remember to flip the image to make sure both sides are balanced. I made a mistake <laughs> a long time ago. My goodness gracious. Falling on the sleep sword? No, why? You just stiff on your screen. <laughs> oh yeah, no. I, I, did you hear me talking? Can you, can no, you not I'm hear me talking? I'm, I'm oh, okay. Yeah, no. I was just uh, thanking everyone and everything, and just going, run, doing a rundown, thanking everyone uh, for the raid and stopping by and talking and all that kind of stuff. And now I am about to raid uh, stealth, is what I was telling people.
what a raid, sword. You're welcome. I like your new, your little, uh, I guess she's supposed to be Rob, like Robin. Who? She's supposed, to, she's supposed to be the woman version of Robin. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this, this is totally a different thing. I was just making it up. Yeah, I like to make shit up. Thank you for the look. Uh, this is, uh, the, the tall girl is actually the little sister to the short girl. Oh, okay. The little girl, um, she don't remember her own, she don't even know her own form because she was locked away for a very long time and the last thing that she remember about herself is a little girl, so which is why you see her as a little girl, but that's not her. Her name is Alma and her little sister name is Alice. They're real, li real life people. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> they just a uh, uh, well. I I play the game called Fear. First encounter assault recon, and to me it was once, and still is the best horror shooting game for me. I love that game. True, love that game. True story. No, never. But the original inspiration was from the true story about a little girl that was I don't remember where it's from but it was inspired by that story but you know, simply put it's not a true story <laughs> I'm just kidding there's this guy right that I listen to as a sport I listen, I'm a sports fanatic so there's a guy I listen to on the radio right and I forget what the show was uh, some movie it was like I'm trying to think of like what the what the movie was but they're talking about this movie it was completely fake movie like it was obviously fake and the guy's like uh <laughs> it was like stretch armstrong or something like that you know like one of those type of shows and the other guy's talking about the movie on the radio another guy goes oh okay true story <laughs> no it's not true it's true story it's stretch armstrong for crying aloud <laughs> Point when <laughs> no point, but that's why I say I'll say that sometimes it's more of like a personal joke. I know it's really not pe true, people, but I'll just be like, Oh, true story. <laughs> You're making me feel bad. I was like, I don't want to disappoint you. <laughs> oh, give me one. Uh, I'm just being stupid. I got a raid for, it was nice of them to raid me. I got a raid of 33 or something like that. I think you were there. And uh, so that's good for about 50 cents right there. <laughs> I'll, I'll, uh, I'll just sit here and uh, entertain everybody while well, Stealth's, not, Stealth's not available right now. So uh, my name is Sword and Keyboard and welcome to Stealth Stream. Uh, super fantastic of you to stop by and uh, visit Stealth. And uh, Stealth is an artist. He does all kinds of artwork. He plays all kinds of first-person shooters, uh, comic book games. Uh, you name it, Stealth plays it. And he's just uh, putting his headphones on right now. He's getting everything all adjusted. He's getting ready to go back to the art table. Uh, he I'm just looked one way. 
and now he's looking the other way, and then he looked the other way again, now he's looking back at you, and I'm doing a play-by-play -play of stealth. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Missed it. I was just narrating. I was just narr narrating stealth stream. Peace. <laughs> What's up, Evil? How you doing, man? He's doing terrible. terrible. Uh oh. Still feeling rough, huh, bud? Yeah. The only time we have a good we we're in a good mood is when Evil Shadow is in a bad mood. I mean. <laughs> oh, that's Forget messed up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Are you good? Do you think you're gonna need an enema? I think Steph gonna need a doctor to remove my foot out of his ass. <laughs> oh shit, that is. That is. That's what I think. Oh man. Sorry you're feeling rough, Eagle. I hope you get to feeling better soon, brother. Thank you, buddy. I know, I heard that the uh, super top secret information was revealed during a stream. Uh, and we need to have Men in Black come out and take care of the situation, I think. Yeah. I had Kim reminded me every five minutes to beat Stealth's ass last night. <laughs> it's what you do best. Uh, I was watching a bit of your stream there, uh, uh, Sword. That uh, that hunting game looks pretty badass. Yeah, I'm just trying to get the hang of it. <clears throat> just learn. <laughs> just bought it today. There you go. There you go. Thanks for popping in. Hey, no problem, brother. Hey, you came into mine last night. I figured I'd throw you a view. Because uh, you helped me big time last night. All y'all did. I, Good. I, hopefully, I, on, you're on your way to getting your affiliate, hopefully. Well, I'm at... When I last checked, I'm at 47, I think. So, just a few more to go. And oh, four, all four of seven streams? 47 followers. Oh, you still need followers. Oh, then once you get the yeah. followers, then you'll have to get your, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, you still, yeah. once you, once you get your followers, I think it, then it, then it becomes active to get your, um, streams in. I'm trying to yeah, I'm not sure if they changed here. that or so not, but that's what it used to be. Right it should be more than 47. I got you a couple more today. Yeah, it, earlier it said 49, um, but, Seven, let's see, ten followers on the seventh, which was yesterday. Two followers today, so somehow it put, put me at forty-seven. But when I uh, when I counted my followers list, it has forty-nine. So I don't know why it's taking so long to update. I need to. Uh, I have another channel that's just a hundred percent racing that I created this summer. I created. A little bit ago, but uh, I just got my 50 on that one, and I need to hopefully get my uh, affiliate here soon for that one. It's gonna be like a, it's gonna be a racing channel that runs uh, league races. You know, I'll run like entire season for like 12 hours, just let it go constantly. Like various people could go on there and watch whenever they want. Right. I remember last night how I was how I was telling you guys like my average viewers was like 1.1 1 .1, now it's up to 1.24, so it's slowly moving up. <laughs> yeah, well the key is don't don't overstream. Keep your streams right. to like an hour hour and a half. Yep, that's exactly what Evil was telling me last night. So we'll make the mistake over streaming. Yeah. And they they can't figure out why they're not getting it well it's because what you need to do is pre-arrange or even take a phone if you have a phone in your house or oh uh, your kids got phones or whatever take their phone put it on there for an hour they give you an extra viewer yeah sounds you know kind of a crappy way to do it but whatever it takes to get it you know 
once you get it, it's just a big relief. You don't have to worry about it again. says 49 followers you'll have 50 in a few minutes <laughs> I got you bro look at you go look at you go I still can't believe I'm almost at 600 that's I never expected to get 600 pretty badass dude I mean my channel is really old too I mean, my, my channel is uh, one of the older Twitch movements I think I started my Twitch channel in 2012 or 11 or something. Yeah. But I just never, I, I never streamed or anything like that. Yeah, I had an account when it was Justin TV. I used to watch uh, NASCAR races and races on Justin TV all the time. Because the people would like live stream. Um, like NFL or sport, if you didn't have TV or a certain station, you could always find it on Justin TV. Ellie's creating Elsa. She got the Glock Glock guys going on. Go, bro, 50 followers, and you'll be probably getting a few more in a little bit, uh, to, just in case some asshole one follows you. Have extra. Yeah, have 50 on my end. You should get four or five more today sometime. forever to update on this thing doesn't it it's been slower and slower lately twitch's uh servers have not been very good lately yeah, I'll scroll down it says 50. I'm not going to send you another email to your stream next time. What's that now? They're not, they're not, they don't send the email when you hit 50. That's what you're asking. Oh, no. I was just looking at something. <laughs> Let's see here. August activity. I have driven 3,371 miles. Over Lincoln and Raymond and places visited. I'll get this. In 2022, so far, I have traveled 87% around the world. I have driven a total of 21,747 miles. This is in what? A game or real life? No, this is real life. This, it's part of my job. 
Where are you traveling to? Well, I drive all over Missouri fixing water softeners and, um, and changing filters and stuff like that. <laughs> that's a long, that's a lot. I used to say the whole world, I thought. <laughs> but no, it's, that's my Google, that's my Google Maps. Okay, okay. Um, it's, it's telling me that so far in 2022, since January of 2022, I've gone 87% around the world driving just between, funny part, funny part is, is it's just driving between Missouri and Kansas. How, how many miles again uh, for how much per month? Right. Well, right now, total traveled is 21,747 miles. In August alone, I did, wow. I've driven 3,371 miles. Oh, okay. All right. I spent 118 hours in my vehicle. Balls, that's a lot. Let's see here. Should we... I used to travel about 1,700 miles per month uh, just to go to work at one point. Just a regular job. Crazy, isn't it? Yeah. I was telling somebody earlier as my stream, I, I figured out I was spending three and, a little over three and a half weeks a year in my car. Jesus. Just to go back and forth to work. <laughs> I was telling about, like, about, um, not try to toot my horn or whatever but like these people that complain about like not being able to pay their school and everything whatever I took a job right and I did a second job just shoveling or doing yard work around people's yards on top of my regular job and this is my 30s and had that commute plus went to school full time at night so like people can make things happen if they really work towards it you just gotta be consistent and not spend your money on stupid shit yeah. or beer or sitting in bars right. just a lot of people who are like ah I don't have any but there's a couple guys too that come in here so I don't care if they I'll say it right in front of them they'll buy the best of everything best of every single thing and have a brand new car and then wonder why they don't have any money right <laughs> damn true yeah. 50 followers on there. Or bit and bitch about that they can't pay their bills. Yeah. Remember that, everyone. Why swear from sword? What the fuck? I'm at the wrong place. Let's do this. I gotta yeah. use me. A lot of these people with the uh, college, they they expect everybody else to pay their college bills, or they flunked out of college, and they expect everyone else to pay their loans. <laughs> I, I I don't mind helping like people that are doing well. Why are we helping people that flunk out? True. It's like a. Want to get all the benefit, but don't want to pull the weight. Yeah, you go to college and party it up for a year, hang out, drink beer, have a great old blast, and then get crew all these college bills, and then you expect, you know, the U.S. government to pay it off. Hey, dog, are you planning on going live? Uh, here in a little while. What's up? Unless somebody else is planning on going live that has more followers than I do, then I will hold I'll be all. sure to look in, lurk in your stream if you go live. I'm, I'm live right now. Gotcha. All right, so we need to manage goal. End goal. Manage goal. What are you playing? What are you playing? There's this place in Missouri I wanted to go to. Um, it's supposed to be super, super amazing de dentist, and um, they had the guy has entire 
this giant building that was probably at one time a um I don't know. It was a nice building. It looks like I don't know if they had it built or it was originally like a furniture store or something. But this huge building and it's all all dentistry inside the build, building. It's, it's in Missouri. That sounds to me like the dental college. It's not a college. One guy owns the whole place. What uh, do you know? What town? I wish I could remember his name. I have to look it up. I got him on. The guy has his own YouTube channel. That's how I found him. And gotcha. he t- talks about you know he does this like progressive dentistry that and does everything instead of like everybody else is pull your tooth happy. This guy's like let's save what you got and try and restore what you have and build on that. And then he builds like um does the uh, uh implants and all that kind of stuff too. I was starting to get to that age where I'm needing some of that work. So I was thinking about going out there because it might be cheaper. Everything here is sky high where I live. So I I can understand that. I live uh, about an hour and a half from New York City on the, so like everything here is like out of control price wise. Gotcha. That is fucking badass boys. I have a question. You say you pl- do. You also play um, the plane sim game very often. Yeah, flight, flight simulator. simulator. Yeah. Yep. Sure do. Uh, had they come up with any mods yet for that that make it into a game? Like, I'd like to play. You know how you play um, truck, uh, you know, like Euro Truck Sim and American Truck Sim. Are you familiar with those games? Basically, yeah. Basically, I want to play the airplane game like you do the truck sim game. So there is, um, oh, what was it? My buddy Overkill uh, put out a video about it. Um, let me give me a minute. He uh, wants a cargo mod. Like a the, oh, there's all kinds of cargo something games. that turns the game into like a mini game of. You know, yeah, yeah, that's, that's owning exactly. your own cargo company or something like that. Yeah, that's that's exactly what I'm talking about. Um, give me just a second. Uh, so whenever it doesn't even have to be today. Just I just. Oh no, oh, I can I can I can find it in no time. Uh, yeah, thank you, Tom. Hurry, right. fuck up. Hey, hey, listen here. I will come through this computer and bitch slap you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I wouldn't feel no worse, buddy. <laughs> oh shit. Let me see. He said that I also got a mod for a control tower where people see the control tower and direct people. Yeah, it's. Uh, I can see Dub doing it. He'd have fun doing that. Uh, yeah, right. You're right. That'd be good for him. Videos. Give me just a sec here. Probably be funny at it, too. How are you feeling, baby cakes? What? How are you feeling? I'm all right. I told him the other day that if I was going to get sick for it to hold off to this weekend, I don't feel it yet. Hopefully I won't. There's a lot of COVID everywhere right now. Mm-hmm. 
It's not like that bad, bad COVID though. I don't think. Though he doesn't sound so great. It's like his is just a cold. Is he, is he still here? You he still here, Evil? Are you just sore throat still, or is that gone? Yeah. Uh, eat some jello and stuff. Started eating some like crushed ice and jello and stuff like that. Come here. Come here, Sassy. I just started eating more jello. I stopped eating jello when I was uh, the hernia thing. I started eating like jello with like fruit cocktail in it. I'm gonna start doing that again. Tasted good. It's so easy to make. Okay, I'm gonna have to message him. Don't worry about it, bud. Whatever. I already got enough money. I almost stayed up for a shotgun again now. I, wanna, okay. I wanted to stream for the past few days. I can't even stream. That sucks. <laughs> All right. I just sent him. I sent him a message on uh, Discord. Uh, he'll let me know, and I'll. Uh, I'll. Uh, I'll. Once I get that information sorted, I'll. I'll hook you up with it. All right. I was just curious. I don't really. I've never played. I have the Xbox Pass, but uh, I haven't really played the game at all. Right. But I was kind of interested. That type of thing would interest me. I like. I don't want to just fly around to fly around. I want to have like a reason to fly around. Right. No. I. Uh, uh, whenever I whenever I do my flights, I, it's just because. Uh, you know, I just do them to do them. Um, but uh, it's for me when you're in when you're doing flight sim. Uh, I'm uh, learning. I need to learn how to use the uh, VAT sim part of it, uh, so that way I can start learning how to do the stuff for. Uh, Air traffic control. Jeez Louise. Wow. You really... like I, well, I just want to kind of just casually get into it if possible. Like play oh, with a controller or whatever. Oh yeah, you can. You can. It's, it's, I can tell you from experience, it is a pain in the ass to uh, try and do it with a, uh, like an Xbox or PlayStation controller. But you can do it. Um, but, uh, yeah, if if anything, um, my my suggestion would be is um, are you or, well? What platform are you going to download it on? Are you going to do it on um, PC, PC or, or Xbox? Probably PC. Okay, PC is probably the best. Um, I would suggest getting a Hotas. That's, that's just my suggestion. Yeah, I probably, if I ever get into Star Citizen, then I probably get a hot, a hot toss. Yeah, it's, it makes life a lot simpler, bro. I promise you. So I haven't really, it's kind of low on my list for investments. You know? Gotcha. No, no, no. Makes sense. I, I, I've been really wanting a better wheel than I have, better race gotcha. wheel. So, I don't know, we'll see. Absolutely. No, 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 no. I wish I could come up. I wish I could come up with these great deals that Evil gets. That the, he gets all these deals from the, like the los, local um, uh, pawn shops. That's where I bought my hotels from. Pawn shop. If I, if I had the great pawn shops that he's at, I'd probably go scavenging pawn, pawn shops every two weeks and then sell the shit online. online.
You ever play Helloborn, J Dog? No, I've never uh, played that. Rihanna. A surprise. Get in the closet for Mama. Um, I've watched you play that. You watched um, me play it? Yeah, you were playing it the other day when that dude scared the hell out of you coming up, sticking his head up behind the pallets, and then you shot him. Oh, no, that's Hell Let Loose. I said oh. Hella Born. Hella Born. No, I've never heard. I've it's never all helicopters. Heard. It's a helicopter game. Oh, well, let me look this up. Hey, you that's why I'm shocked. Toss, I'm shocked, Gina. Mm -hmm. I've used my hot toss when I was You probably crazy. really love it if you like yeah. these kind of games you're playing. Yeah, I, I was shocked you ain't heard him play that. Well, Y'all, you and Sword used to play together, right? What do you and Sword? Yeah, we played it for a good two, three weeks or something like that, I think. Oh, it's yeah. called what again? Hello Born. Hell, uh, Born. H E L I. Heli Born, yeah. B O R N E. Like helicopter, Heli Born. I actually wouldn't mind revisiting it. It's that. like uh, Vietnam, I think, type of thing. Okay, Heli Born Collection. Here we go. Let's, uh,. Highly recommend buying that when it goes on sale. Uh, 20, 25 bucks ain't bad. You get it cheaper. 30 bucks ain't bad. Probably get it on G G2A. G2A or something. You never saw that game before? I'm looking at it now. Interesting. Sometimes, sometimes, it. sometimes you just gotta look at it. Yeah, just gotta look at it. $3. And right now, Stealth is looking at his picture and then looking back at his, well, his paintbrush. <laughs> and now he's doing some new strokes. And... He can buy it right now for $5. Oh, um, buy that man that can. I'll buy it for you. This is looking pretty badass. They even stealth would like that game. <sighs> Hellie Born? Yeah. Not his thing. Not his thing. I didn't oh, do see you that. like crafts? That. Do you like crafts? Like uh player planes and stuff like that at all? Stealth? I used to play do do with flight. I'm all Hellborn's about it. pretty cool. And yeah, you get it super cheap. I don't know how pe people you can play with Hellborn. That looks pretty badass. But the question is, is it all, is it like always behind? Or do you have the view from the inside? I'm pretty sure you could switch views. View from the inside, how I play. Okay, that shows partial controller support. I think you look at the inside, right, so Yeah. It's got all a bunch of different views you can use. Go. There you go. Download and find out. I want to stream and play this. Yeah. Okay. What? How do I do this? Uh, yeah, take that code and put it in the bottom. On the open up Steam. Uh huh. And click Add Game at the left hand corner at the bottom. And click Activate a Product on Steam. Okay. Wait a second. So, wait. Hold on a second. I gotta look at something here. Oh, shit. Really? Um, let's see if we're gonna... Fuck. Why? What the actual... Okay. Um, sorry. Um, apparently there's a bunch of downloads for Steam here. Um, for Arma 3 and Obsidio and all this other... Oh, you play Arma 3, huh? Uh, I've tried it. <laughs> Put it that way. Oh, I assume you don't like it. Um, I haven't really messed with it all that much, to be honest with you. Okay, so we'll go to store here. So just click add to cart. No. Uh -huh. The bottom of your this uh, Steam, click add a game. Bottom left hand corner. Oh, oh okay. It, Activate click. a product on Steam. Yes. Click okay. next. Sure. Click I agree and copy and paste that code in there. <laughs> okay. 
Let's see. I, hell, I can just type it in. You can type it in. You can always just type it in. Say it too loud, okay? Still copy the top of the passenger. That's what I do best. I was really impressed with the cartoon that they had in this hunter game. that game is I don't think a lot of people know what that game is that's part of its problem it's a lot wait, of people wait. don't it's under it's an undiscovered game really gotcha gotcha it's really it's got really good missions in it though you have to uh, pick it's got all kinds of missions in it you take you drop off troops you pick up wounded troops you pick up soldiers you give them cover fire you blow up shit I mean it's a great game all diff all kinds of helicopters. Actually, I need to re revisit that game. We had a lot of fun on that shit. Yeah. Then we burnt out of it. We played it so much. It's a really good game. If I recall, though, I had little issues with with the enhanced edition. Maybe they had them fixed with my hotos. I had to play the uh, the classic version. If I recall. Maybe they fixed it by now, because that was a long time ago. Um, uh, Sword. Yep. Sword, you still with me? It's called it's called Neo Fly. Okay. Look it that's, up. Yeah, that's what it is. There's a uh, there's a program that I'm not sure how you, I can't remember how you add it in, but that's the name of it. Thank you. And you. Can, you can buy different planes and like the cargo can be passengers or just like regular cargo or whatever but you have to start out with a certain type of aircraft and then as you go on you can buy other aircraft and you can get other pilots to do other jobs for you and stuff like that neo fly yeah neo fly neo fly i knew my boy overkill would come through for me if you ever get a chance uh, uh if you ever go on to uh youtube and whatnot uh, check out his videos. Um, uh, it's Overkill Productions or Overkill Simulations or something like that. Wow. Um, but uh, Photoshop just yeah, caused he's, me to he does some really good tutorials and things like that. Um, wow, but, he even uh, has picking yeah. up uh, picking up uh, emergency and stuff like that. Uh huh. Yeah, he's he's got all kinds of this. This guy is. I, I have to admit, one of the best YouTube streamers I think I've ever gotten the chance to know, to be rightfully honest. Hold What's his name again? Moment. Overkill. There we go. Oh, he must have you had his channel that. for a long time. That's a oh, that would be a tough he, name yeah. to get. That would be a tough name to get. Yeah, he um, uh, he's in all honesty, I, uh, he is a great dude um he pretty much allows anybody in his discord i mean hell he's got probably over 600 people in his discord um but it's a it's a pretty well uh, tight-knit community where they uh Got a lightning uh, bolt on his channel stand by 134,000 uh, subscribers let me oh no this i don't think this is channel this is some guy playing minecraft and stuff here, I'll, this uh, is gonna take a while. Let me throw. Make sure you have a strong RAM. Uh, Mine is strong, but still Photoshop. I think it's the size of the canvas. Do you mind if I uh, post this in your channel, Evil? 
uh, in advertising, post whatever you want in there. Okay. No, uh, it's, it's it's better to ask for permission than to beg for forgiveness, bro. <laughs> Where did the advertising go? While oh, waiting. Here to talk. There it is. For the damn oh, hell, I was already on the damn page. Let's see what huh. we can take. No, reference. that's not what I want. What the? What the? What, what the? Actual F is going on here? This is a good one. Not in the oh, place. I know. I know. There here we go. go. Now we I know what to do. Give me just a second. Whew. I'm going to save that as a design. I am NASCAR. Shut up. All right, here it is. Uh, it's in the advertising. Yeah, I got um, it. I got it or right anything. Oh, well, fuck. <laughs> um, that's just one of his videos that I threw in there. But uh, like I said, he's. Yeah, his tutorials and stuff like that are just phenomenal um, and the stuff that he puts out is is really really good I like I like that guy he's awesome so Filling up for it, Evil. Uh, tomorrow uh, evening, uh, if you want to help me with that other streaming stuff, I'd be grateful if you if you're filling up to it, dude. Okay, buddy. I know I know how rough it can it can feel. <laughs> God, I can't believe it's almost 9.30 hey, already. Up. I don't know why I'm getting sleepy. And I'm kind of hungry, too. Well, it, it's called food. They're just, yeah. It, it, there's delicious things out there that you can, that you can do to uh, take care of the hunger. I forgot to eat. Oh, you shouldn't forget, my friend. I think I'm gonna go. Uh, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get some, have some Rice Krispies. There you go. That if that doesn't say America right there. <laughs> America, fuck yeah. America, Rice Krispies. <laughs> what kind of thing is that? America, fuck yeah, fuck yeah. <laughs> Malaysian, fuck though. <laughs> B2s are working hard tonight. <laughs> Crazy bastards. I live right next to a uh, Air Force base, so the the some of the B2s are housed down here. God damn. They're being loud tonight. Must be time for their night missions. Where's the blood? I have a blood brush. Well, what's really awesome is uh, some mornings when they have early morning flights and whatnot, I just stand out on my deck and I'll watch two or three of them take off while I'm 
freaking uh, drinking a cup of coffee, and it's just like, yeah, that's America. That's pretty good. <laughs> I'll, uh, one of these days I'll get some video of it. I'll post in, uh, I'll show you guys. I'll post a video so you guys can see it. It's pretty cool. If you're interested, anyway. Fuck yeah. Kind of a cool idea. That would be a good idea so for some uh, TikTok content. Because I live right next to... I live right near two airports. I'm like sandwiched. Like I have one air airport like 10 minutes away from me and another one like about 15. Nice. Uh, oh, and as long as I'm still able to do it on the uh, 4th of July, last, last, uh, this last past uh, 4th of July... I actually did a Twitch stream of uh, shooting off fireworks, which was pretty cool. I wish I would have recorded if I would have known how to uh, record it at the time. It would have been on my channel, but uh, my son was doing the camera work and uh, he was telling everybody on Twitch what I was shooting off and all that good stuff. And <laughs> he was talking to all the people on Twitch, which was pretty cool. I only had two viewers, but it was worth it. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, I mean, why not? Broadcast it. Show it to the world. I like Roman candles. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I had some, uh, I had some actually, per I had a pretty good aerial display. Um, had a bunch of fountains and things like that. You know, yeah, it's just pretty cool. I mean, a lot of people don't like the stuff, the small stuff, but I like Roman candles, and I've seen some really cool stuff that you put on the ground and make all kinds of crazy colors. Yeah, I uh, uh, had this one. Uh, oh, it was. Uh, oh, they were they were mortar shells, but my God, they were loud. I don't know. I don't know what I bought, but it was worth it. It was it was really badass. Did you say mortar yeah, shells? Yeah. I sure did. I never forget the football player on a Giants blew half his hand off. Fireworks. Yeah, funny. funny part was, is I was lighting off pretty much four out, four of them at a time. Uh, I'm crazy when it comes to pyrotechnics. <laughs> Expensive. Fuck. did it in the wrong layer. Now I have to redo it. Please excuse my language. I know my language can be foul, but <laughs> I don't know why. Excuse me. Oh yeah, sword. I, I just wanted to say thank you, sword. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you, buddy. You're welcome. Thanks to people like you, we can have a September. Appreciate you. <laughs> what? Because uh, it's thanks to the love. Lenovo, they're the sponsor <laughs> for something. I know you get big time supporters, so I just want to say thank you so, for that discount you give everybody. You're very welcome. Thank you, Lenovo, for shoving it up my asshole. September is, September is sponsored by Lenovo. Thank you, Lenovo, for my shitty second rate Chinese motherboard. 
I, I appreciate, seconds. appreciate you, buddy. Thank you. You're welcome. You, Lenovo. Peter, that left. Dad. Thank you, Lenovo, for my shitty no-name generic RAM that you put in my computer, but told me I was getting the best of everything. I, I saw that last night, actually. It said sponsored by Lenovo, and I was like, damn it, I got to thank Sword. I just rem remembered it. I was like, I got to thank Sword for his uh, contribution to making stuff. I read their website, and I'm like, what a bunch of bullshit. They, they put all oh, premium this, gamer this, gamer. It's such horse shit. Make it September. Garbage possible. computers. Dude, it is downloaded. All right. Well, what better way to do this? You know what? We're gonna go. You should make a meme like that and put a sword on there. It'd be like, thanks to people like this guy, sub timber is possible. <laughs> <laughs> My teeth are all broken, but I got a good Lenovo computer. <laughs> Thank you, Lenovo, for not allowing me to use my computer three of the nine months that I've had it. This computer, this shout out's for you, Lenovo. Why don't you do that and hashtag and then and add a Lenovo on Twitter? <laughs> yeah, thank shit. you Lenovo for sub Tanner. I really appreciate you. I, I, you saw me this $1,400 computer that broke after three months. So, so grateful for gracious. Took you three months to fix the fucking thing, you fucks. Excuse me, sorry. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. You didn't, you didn't oh see how everybody's dream says Lenovo? Yeah, I see it. That's funny. I was pissing and moaning about it to myself the other day. That's fucking hilarious. Up, oh, man? you gotta be shitting me. Apparently, I'm a legend at uh, TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Like, this shit was funny, dude. We had a meeting tonight, right? It was TikTok management that were, that were running the gaming program. And um, a lawyer from Carter Pulse and there was like a hundred streamers there right you hear me yes yes no. okay yes, what? Yes, say yes. again i couldn't hear i couldn't hear you say again so the managers come into the stream Can you start from the beginning i couldn't hear you you know what sword <laughs> so the like managers, subscribe thank you the managers start the the meeting right and they said oh look it's so good to see panda guy here and and his friend doge they didn't call anybody else out. They just literally came in and said, hey, everybody, welcome to the meeting. Good to see Panda Guy and his friend Doge here. And then they just like, let's get on with the meeting. Like, and like, I was like, holy shit. Like everybody in the room in the chat, so I was like, hey, Panda, what's up, man? Like, <laughs> so yeah, like apparently they know me and they like me. So that's a good thing, I guess. <laughs> okay, so... God darn it, people like me. I was shocked. Wow. Well, like to get called out by their staff, like in a meeting like that. That's, that's pretty, pretty good though. Yeah, that's, that's pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's pretty cool. I'm happy I was, for you. I was pretty yeah. happy. I'm gonna see if somebody recorded it and then get a clip of it, but I don't I don't know yet if anybody recorded it. Well when you become famous and shit, don't forget about your goddamn friends, bro. <laughs> yeah, of course I wouldn't. Yeah. My friend I do have a recording. My friend, he was in a meeting with them, like a private meeting yesterday, and he mentioned to them he said this was Doge and he said he showed me the meeting, I've got a recording of that, and he said to the the staff, he was like, Oh yeah, my friend, you know, Panda guy, Panda X guy and she goes, oh, yeah, of course we know Panda. Like, well, yeah, Panda's not like, you know. And then later in the meeting, there was a reference because he was talking about, they were talking about his content. And she said, she even said to him, well, you're very knowledgeable. You're like, she, she literally goes in the middle of the meeting, like just out of randomness. She goes, yeah, you're you're a lot like Panda guy that yeah, like, the two of you are very knowledgeable in the gaming space in general. So, yeah, so we've definitely made a good impression with them. <laughs> so... I will tell you, um, I may not be around as much because I did I did accept the part time job today, so I'm gonna be working three days a week. What you doing? Uh, we got a, I took a job. I got offered a job at Publix. Publix? Yeah. Do you not have those by you? You should do videos uh, for TikTok and be like, look at people really like me at Publix. 
Publix is uh Look at I'm everybody gonna... likes me. Look how much they all love me at Publix. Publix yeah, you know is the great. Sword. Everyone you know loves what... me. Sword shush. Um, I'm not even sure what fucking Publix is. Publix is a super, store. It's a supermarket. It's oh. a supermarket. They offered me. They like. They really like me because they. They. They right there in the interview. She's. I was like. So what's the process? She goes. Oh, don't worry. She's like. I'm gonna make you a job offer right now. I was like. Okay. And they offered me to start as a. And I was like shocked because I mean maybe this is normal now, but they offered me thirteen dollars and fifty cents an hour to start as a part time fucking cashier. I was like that. That's fucking pretty good. I can't <laughs> wait I, until your neighbor comes in there and sees you as a cashier. And then they were like, and then she was like, we, we, she's like, we're going to be hiring a customer server service uh, person, which cause so they, cause the way they work is the cashiers report to the customer service person in charge. And then that person reports to the managers. And she said, um, we're going to be hiring a customer service person in like the next couple of months. And she's like, we don't hire from the outside. We always promote for win. And she's like, I already can tell. I think that would be the perfect job for you. She's like, you're going to be the top of my list for uh, promotion to that if you're interested. So, which would mean like making like $17 an hour. <laughs> I worked in a grocery store before. I worked in produce. Yeah, I did it when I first, uh, when I was a teenager. I worked in this grocery That's why I think they liked me too, because I worked there for five years. I can't wait till that lady with the white van comes in there. She's, they said they were hiring produce people too, because she asked me, she's like, "Are you applying for, for cashier or produce? Because they really need people in produce." And she's like, "No, it's not the greatest job." But I was like, "No, no, I'm, I'm here for the cashier job. I don't worry about that." If you want to make money, <laughs> cashier, cashiers, the in any grocery store, yeah. you want to get noticed, be working cashiering. Yep. Yeah. I know. So when I first started, I was a stock boy. Well, I started, I started as a porter in a bakery when I was 14 for like a couple of months. Hated it, and then I got a job as. Um, I got a job as stock boy, which I did that for like a year. And I was sitting there like, I was like now 15, right? And I'm like, damn, all the, all the, all the stock boys are always trying to go up to the registers and talk to the girls because all the cashiers were girls and they got paid. We were all union. So like everybody knew who, how much everybody made because, and we made like stock boys made like six fifty an hour and cashiers were making like seven fifty an hour. So I was like, they get paid better and it's all the girls. So I applied for cashier and they hired me. And they sent me to the training school for the supermarket. And they, even the supermarket said, they were like, you know, you're the first male cashier we've ever had in the store. <laughs> this was in the 80s. So, yeah. And so, uh, but I got the job and I, I got to hang out with all the girls and make a dollar more an hour than everybody else doing it. So I was happy. Nice. <laughs> Times have changed though, huh? Okay. So I've managed to make it up. Working at, as a cashier at grocery store is going to be better than going to bars for you. I mean, you know, like the thing is, I have a cap on how much I can make every month. I can't make more than thirteen fifty a month, so that means I can't, I can't at thirteen fifty an hour. I can't work more than twenty four hours in a week. So, and they've already told me that they're completely fine with that. So, they just basically said if I if if the schedule comes out with more hours, I just need to let them know so they'll take the hours back off. Because apparently the. It's like, it's very like computerized. They don't really, the computer makes the schedule <laughs> and then they have to go back and edit it, but it's, they don't really like pick the shifts. It's more of the computer does it. So, so we'll see, I, you know, I'm excited. It'll be nice to get out of the house three days a week, you know? Yeah, you'll probably get, I guarantee you'll get dates out of it. No, you know, you know hey, you never know. Cause it's all who shops, women. Oh my God, dude, there were so many fucking hot women. There. I was sitting there at the bench. They have like a bench that's like behind all the registers uh, along the wall. And then like to the left was like where the offices were. So they told me to sit on the bench and wait, dude. And I was sitting there like, I, I sat there for 45 minutes and I was not bored because like there were so many hot fucking chicks, dude. So many. And half of them were fucking half naked too. You just get a card, get your card out and give me your card for TikTok. It might be a Southern thing or something that just half of them weren't wearing many clothes. <laughs> you just wear a shirt every day. So you should put a little shirt underneath your little smock that tells your, has your channel on it and then just have it underneath the like, subscribe. Some business cards and drop it in everybody's bag. <laughs> I would. That's what I told Dub to do. I have little like stickers with my name on it. Give them out. 
I told the made some business cards. They were worse at that damn store and, and dropping it in everybody's fucking land on the way out. I used to uh, put these little business cards when I had my race league. I used to put the the boxes where the NASCAR games were. I used to put business cards there. It just basically shows. Game, so it wasn't like a real business card. It just had like the yeah. league name and the internet address on it. I got a lot of a lot of people joining from that. To so go to like two or three different Best Buys. Oh wow! I didn't know this. My mom actually saw the Queen in person. My mom just posted on Facebook. She said, "I'm truly saddened by the news from the UK today. I only saw the Queen in person once when she came to the throne as a schoolgirl in a massive crowd of school children. She drove around the stadium on on her, on her Land Rover." I'm going to have to go to the throne pretty soon. This is actually pretty tight, Evil. Oh, okay. Fucking me up. Oh, they just blew me up. <laughs> Are you playing Hellborn now? Yeah. It's a pretty challenging game. That's selling um, you can where you can build your own R two D two. Oh, yeah, that's cool. I've seen and some homemade ones. It. You can control it from an app. After assembly, you can control R two D two from your smartphone or tablet. Control movement, moving parts such as his head, retractable arms, project images of Princess Leia or Luke Skywalker, record videos and take photos with the R two D two, and activate a hidden pop up lightsaber. How much? It doesn't say. It says like you get. You, it's like you subscribe to this thing. I this saw somebody running something like that. He said it was homemade though. It was in uh, Asia or somewhere. The guy was doing it. It was with one streamer that I watch, and he they were getting so much content by just bringing that thing around malls. They're bringing around malls, and they were getting so much content, like people walking up to it and interacting with it. It says you pay like a dollar to get the book. And then, and then, like, there's assembly stages that they send you parts. So each assembly stage is thirteen ninety nine, fourteen dollars. Yeah, and then you have to you have to pay monthly, and they, each month they send you more of the parts. Yeah, I wouldn't want to do that. It's, it's, it's like, but I guess it's a lot of work. Like, you literally have to build it from scratch. It's interesting though. It'd be kind of cool to have one. I'd buy one of the finished project. I don't want to build it though. The only shit part about this thing is I can't. What are you doing? I'm trying to figure out how to get this thing to land. What are you playing? The that helicopter game. Oh. <laughs> The Bank of England has confirmed that cash and coins will continue to be legal tender temporarily, but will announce more plans for the transition to the King Charles money after the nation's mourning period. See, they have to, they have to recall in the entire British currency. Not to mention that she's on the currency of 30, the currency in 33 different countries.
Well, they don't really need to change that right away. Well, they're saying they will. At least in England, they will. They're saying after the after the mourning period is over, they're going to. Um, that's just going to be calling collectors' items now. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, you need to get that shit now. In the UK alone, there is currently 80 billion pounds of money in circulation featuring Queen Elizabeth. Um, on your game in Steam, right, right click on your game in Steam, uh, the Steam list, uh, J Dog. Hang on a minute. I have a whole box full of German money from World War II. I should probably try and sell it off. You know, if you think about it, they'll we'll, we'll never, none of us here will ever see a queen again in our lifetimes. There may never be a queen again, and if even if there is, it's probably it would be like hundreds of years from now. Because right now it's all boys. There's King Charles, then his son Prince William, and then after Prince William is Prince George. What the after, hell? After that is Prince Princess Charlotte, but that's she's fourth down. Oh, she, what about Philip? She'll never be. She'll never be queen, probably, because Prince George will be king. And that, so, if and when Prince George has children, his children will be the next in succession, anyway. Who'd you say about who? What's the guy that got in trouble with uh with the young girls? Oh, Prince Andrew. He was never in the line of succession, though. Is he the brother of Philip? Philip was the dad. Yeah, Philip was the dad. Yeah, he's Charles. Charles is the, the Charles is Charles's brother, but it's always the oldest child. So Charles is the oldest child. The guy um, you just said a minute ago. What was his name again? Andrew. Yeah, he's Andrew Charles. He's trouble. Charles's brother. Yeah. He's his younger brother. But that's why he won't, he was never in the line of sisters. Like he wasn't. Well, what? Could be, but well, like, if, it would if Philip, be, if Charles dies. No, if Charles if Charles dies, it goes to his son, which is Prince William. Like all of his like heirs have to die first, then it would go back to his brother. So like, because it's like Prince William, Prince George, all these people would have to die, and then it would go back to his brother. So there's it's like virtually impossible, unless the entire family dies like in a plane crash or something. Huh? What were you want me to do now? Um, right click on your game on the Steam list. Uh huh. Go to uh, properties. Uh huh. You go to betas. Okay. It's got a drop down list. Yep. Do you have Hellborn Original? Hellborn Original, yes. That's the one that worked for my hotels. Oh, okay. I had issues with enhanced this. Alright. So I've selected that. And I mean, it's now downloading. If you're having issues, then try that. Well, it was, I mean, it was kind of working, but, uh, you know, views weren't changing or anything like that. So now it's downloaded. Give it a go here. What it says is actually two games. Right. Um, the original company built the original Hellborn and another game development company bought the game and they did their own version it's called the enhanced edition okay so it's actually it's the same game but by two different companies and, and it's, it's uh, i think the enhanced edition is kind of broken i mean but i tried it it was so i went back and played the original it, it the original uh, i didn't ever have no issues with it it's telling me that now i can't get into it it's like it's doing some sort of update or something. Collection update. Okay. Yeah, it's going to reach. It's going to uh, download the original game files and probably overwrite the enhanced ones. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that. I was wondering why last time I played it, I didn't really like it as much. That's the reason why. That's the reason why. I like the original one better. Yeah, it keeps doing some sort of update thing, but it won't let me in. It'll gonna probably take a little bit. It's going to rewrite all your here. all the files back to the original. It's gotta yeah, go. It's it, right now. It's saying it's already completed. So, 
thank you very much Whoa. to everyone I don't think you can who is that dropping fast. by my stream. That's what I'm showing. Uh, go back into it. Let's go. Yeah, I'm gonna end my stream here. Maybe we should go and raid someone. As a matter of fact, there's no one online. <laughs> So, I guess I'll end my stream here. Wow. The thing is, the developers just posted uh, last everyone Tuesday. They were been not away. turning the servers off. And anyway, thank you very much again. to everyone who is dropping by my stream. Um, nice. I'm going to end my stream here. I'm going to continue with art again soon, or maybe perhaps tomorrow. So, yeah. I'll see you I all again whenever, we, whenever we can drop by. Bye-bye. Did you know that there were so many posts on Twitter about the Queen that that fucking Twitter fucking crashed this afternoon a couple of times, and now there's tonight there's been on TikTok it's been like one thing after another on TikTok, um, and TikTok is fucking crashed too. That's how much fucking people are like tweeting about it. Yeah, I seen some things saying it's gonna be the world's uh, biggest funeral in history. Yeah, and, and the twenty first it's gonna be the biggest event of the twenty first century. That's what they've been saying. It's gonna be it's, this funeral won't even be for like nine more days, and then they they shut down the entire country, including the stock markets and everything. Will completely so close. Heavy people's already standing out in front of the palace. Yeah. Holy yeah. fuck. They had it. They've already. They were dispatching like police. They already knew. Like they. They had to know for a while because, like, even an hour before they announced it, like they had the guards, the royal guards, put out like a message that they were not going to be doing their normal change of guard ceremonies and stuff, which is that that's never happened. And then they were saying that police, police, and like um, military people, like national guard type things, were getting dispatched and like all over Eng all over London because they know like in London they were expecting like large crowds of people in the streets so like they were already making preparations for all that kind of stuff like like hours before they announced it officially all these preparations have been in effect for years yeah it's called opera it was called uh, there's two different ones it was called operation um, uh, London London was it London bridges falling and then there's another one that most people don't know about called operation unicorn Operation Unicorn, so Operation London, like oh, London Bridge is down, is what it was called. That one is like the main one that 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 sets out all the things that are going to happen. And then an Operation Unicorn was just in case what would happen if she died in Scotland, which is actually what happened. She died in Scotland, so Bal Balmaro's in Scotland. So Operation Unicorn is what starts it, and then the, all the funeral arrangements are done through the whole. Uh, but th it was interesting because, uh, like, I'd say before even the police got dispatched onto the streets in London and the guards said they weren't doing that, like, like an hour before.